Welcome. In this video, I will cover extended numbered access list. To know how access list works and the access list rules, click on the links at the top right corner of this video. In our scenario, we want to preventing the ICMP echo or ping from network 192.168.10.0 from accessing only network 192.168.30.0, this network. Before we start the configuration, PC0 with IP address 192.168.10.2 can access or can ping 30.2, also can ping 50.2. Let's see, click on PC0 as IP 10.2, ping 192.168.30.2. Reply, okay, so it can access 30.2. Let's see, ping to 50.2. Reply also it can access 50.2. Let's configure the access list because we want filtering the packets based on a specific protocol and board only ICMP packets. You should use extended access list because the standard access list filters the packets based on source IP address only. Because we want to use an extended access list you should place the access control list as close to the source. We want to preventing network 10, this is the source, from binging or sending ICMP echo packet to network 30. This is the destination. So you should place the access control list as close to the source or as close to the network 10. So you should place the access control list on router 0 or on this router. Let's configure the extended access control list on this route. Click on this router, click CLI, enable confd access list extended, sorry, and here type the access control list number. In the extended access control list, you should type any number between 100 and 199. So for example here, 110, deny, Question mark. You should specify the protocol. We want to deny ICMP, so I want to use this protocol ICMP. If you want to deny FTP, FTP uses TCP protocol, so you should type TCP. But here in our scenario, we want to use ICMP. ICMP. Now type the source IP address. We want denying network 192. Dot one sixty eight dot ten dot zero with wildcard mask, not subnet mask. So click zero to zero to zero to two twenty five to two fifty five. This is the source IP address. We want to deny this source IP address from reaching the destination IP address one ninety two one sixty eight dot thirty dot zero with those wildcard mask and type the port or the service question mark you should use the echo bing if you want to deny network 10 from exiting network 30 ftb you should type here the port number of ftb 21 this is the complete command we want to deny network 10 from binging or sending icmp echo packets to network 30 and we want to permit anything else permit i will choose here ib ib means any protocol so i want to permit any protocol from any network or from any source ib to any destination ib so in this access list i deny network 10 to reach network 30 but not all protocols just eco service bing service okay and permit everything else permit any source ip from accessing any destination ip i want to apply this access control list on a specific interface i will apply it in fast 00 interface or router 0 interface fast 00 ip access group 110 n I will use inbound direction. I used inbound because I want to filter the packets on this interface before the packets would be routed to the other interface. 
For more details about the inbound direction and outbound direction, click on the link at the top right corner of this video. Press enter. Now let's check. Go to BC2. BC2. BC2 was pinging to, th to 30 to 2 and 50 to 2. Now, after I configure this axis control list, ping 192.168 to 32, enter destination host are reachable. Destination hosts are reachable because the access control list in this router prevent this packet from accessing network 30. But I permitted everything else. So if I ping to 50.2, I can reach 50.2. Thank you for watching.